when you consider buying eggs next time, it is important to look for whether they are cage-free, free-range, or pasture-raised eggs. Because not all eggs are created equal. Some egg producers may require that their hens have access to certain amount of outdoor space, while others may not have any requirements at all. Before we go further, let's see the potential benefits of eggs. Eggs are good for building muscles and losing fat, better for our brain, and fantastic for optimizing our hormones. However, the problem is many eggs come from unhealthy hens. Therefore, the eggs are also unhealthy. You may wonder what to do. It is always good to check if the eggs are certified by a third party organization like Certified Humane or Animal Welfare Approved, which ensures that the ends are raised according to animal welfare standards and certain nutrition. Now let's see the difference between free range, cage free and pasture raised eggs. Hey there, welcome back. You're with me on Be Your Moon, not a star. Many of us might assume that cage-free ends offer outdoor access based on the term cage-free. This misconception can lead to disappointment because cage-free ends typically don't have outdoor access. These ends are housed in indoor environments that offer more room for movements, spreading their wings, perch, and laying their eggs in a nesting area but they don't enjoy the benefits of the outdoors. Some data suggests that cage-free eggs may not contain omega-3 fatty acids and vitamin D because these ants are not exposed to natural sunlight and do not forge on a diverse diet. I believe the term cage-free might be a marketing strategy. Who knows? Anyway, which brings us to the next one, free range eggs. Free range eggs are produced by hens that are given more living space and outdoor access compared to cage free eggs. The term free range implies that these hens are allowed to roam outdoor space freely and engage in natural behaviors like forging, dust bathing, scratching, and socializing with other birds. Outdoor access is essential for hens to exhibit their natural instincts and that can result in eggs with a different taste and nutritional profile due to increased outdoor physical activity. The specific criteria for free range eggs can be varied between regions and countries. The USDA the United States Department of Agriculture mandates that all egg producers must show the free range egg layers have access to the outdoors. There is some evidence to suggest that free range eggs may be healthier than cage free eggs. For example, a study published in the Poultry Science Journal shows that free range eggs have higher level of omega-3 fatty acids and vitamin D compared to cage-free eggs. And which brings us to the last one, pasture-raised eggs. Pasture-raised ends are typically provided with outdoor access and allowing them to roam freely in a pasture or outdoor area. The outdoor access enables them to eat insect, plants, and other natural foods, which can result in more nutritious diet for the hens. Pasture-raised eggs also contains higher level of omega-3 fatty acids and vitamin D due to varied diet and outdoor access. The yolks of these eggs are more vibrant in color and taste. Overall, when you consider buying eggs next time, it is good to check 
If the eggs are certified by a third party organization like Certified Humane. And more important to look for whether they are cage free, free range, or pasture raised eggs. And last but not least, in my opinion, it is always better to get eggs from the local farmer's market. Guys, if you find this video informative, smash that like button and subscribe to my channel. Be a moon, not a star. We'll see you there in another video two weeks from now. Until then, I am Prakash. Signing off.